conditional use permit. Grizzly bear hunts in Idaho and Wyoming are off after a judge said the Trump administration's removal of federal protection for grizzlies was premature, but environmentalists want more than just protecting grizzlies from hunters. They want grizzly bears reintroduced to historical habitat, including a large chunk of central Idaho. Steve Liebenthal has the story in tonight's edition of Idaho Backroads. Last week, a federal judge in Montana ruled that the population of grizzly bears in the greater Yellowstone ecosystem is not enough to justify last year's removal of protection from the Endangered Species Act. One of the plaintiffs says the 700 or so Yellowstone grizzlies comprise a fraction of the species' historic population. Grizzly bears still only occupy 5%, less than 5% of their historic range. Yellowstone grizzly bears are completely isolated from any other grizzly bear population, and that's just not recovery under the Endangered Species Act. Last week's ruling effectively stopped hunts for grizzly bears in Idaho and Wyoming. It's disappointing for us and for the hunters uh, from the two states that had hunts uh, scheduled to to take place. Boudreaux says the hunter who drew the single grizzly tag in Idaho has asked for a rain check. If the Fish and Game Commission doesn't approve, he will receive a refund. But the tribes and environmental groups who sued want more than just stopping hunters from killing grizzlies near Yellowstone Park. They want to see grizzly bears roaming from Yellowstone all the way to the Canadian border. We think that grizzly bears need to establish throughout, you know, their recovery zones in the lower 48 before removing federal protection. One of those recovery zones is the Selway Bitterroot Wilderness in central Idaho. Many Idahoans say reintroducing grizzlies would pose a risk not only to humans but to other species especially endangered salmon populations, which were a main source of food when the bears thrived here. Boudreaux says he doesn't think grizzlies will roam the Selway Bitterroot anytime soon. Recovering the Selway Bitterroot is so far beyond from where we're at now with the Yellowstone or the NCDE um, that, you know, it's probably not an issue or going to be an issue for decades. The governor's office plans to meet with officials from Wyoming and Montana to decide how to respond to the relisting of Yellowstone grizzlies. Steve Liebenthal, Six on Your Side. Lieutenant Governor Brad Little tells Six on Your Side he's not certain how the states will respond, but says the judicial